Hey, how's it going, guys? Um, whoa, that's weird. Anyway, um, today I'm going to be teaching you, you how to play um, System of a Downs Chop Suey. This is the more advanced version, I can promise you. This is going to be the most accurate how to play video. I've been looking around and it's going to be the more advanced version. I'll probably put on a simpler version later. Okay, the first thing what you want to do is have your guitar in the drop C tuning. Um, drop C, for those of you who don't know, which happens a lot, is drop D down one whole step. So if you put your finger on the second fret, it should sound like you're in drop, drop D. Down. Okay, that's enough of that. You probably already know. Who cares? Anyway. So the first thing you want to do in the beginning, the it's kind of a reverse power chord. You put your index finger on the fourth string down, fifth fret, and your ring finger on the seventh fret, third string down. And you slide up one whole step to seven and nine. Here's where some people get where it gets tricky. Then you slide down, you keep that same formation, only you go from one whole step away to one half step away. To four and five. Then you do the keep that same two formation and slide down to two and three. Now it's just one guitarist in this band, Darren Malakian, but it sounds like through the whole song that there are two guitars. And I like to do the second guitar and I don't know how much people you would. Anyway. I messed up there on talking. I can do that sometimes. Anyway, that's beside the point. To play the other guitar part, it's pretty much the same exact thing. I like to lift my fingers to mute it. Hope maybe you do too. I add that last. Just because of force of habit, if you want to, it sounds pretty cool. On the second fret, third string down. That's an if you want to. So anyway, after all that, you have to get really high up on the last two strings. What you want to do is keep that same reverse power chord formation, I don't know if there's a real name for that. Put it on the 8th and 10th fret. Slide up to 10 and 12. Then you want to do that only two frets being used. You go down to 7 and 8, but you keep this and you slide all the way up to 12 and 13, only after you do that, you go back to using your ring, ring, fing, ring finger, slide up, so you're on 13 and 15, I can't really show it here on the camera. 13 and 15 on that reverse power chord, okay, you get what I mean? Then you keep using your first and third finger, slide down to 12 and 10 and 12, you slide back right to where you were. So it should sound like...
And here's where it gets tricky for some. If it hasn't been hard enough, you might want to check out my more beginner's version, which I'll be posting later. So don't go look for it. I'll put up a link to it on this uh, video. Anyway, so this is kind of a wild finger action right here. You pretty much do this. You bar, it's pretty much one big. What you want to do is alternate fingers. Some people do it like this. I just do it like this. Either way is comfortable for you. What you want to do is go 8787 you know what I mean. See, that's kind of the wild version. Now you pretty much keep that same exact thing, only you use one string, the first string, on the seventh, sixth, ninth, twelfth. That's pretty much, I think, the easiest part of the song, so... Just the one string and a straight shot. Okay, I'm taking up way too much time, let's keep going. Um, in the verse, it's pretty much the same thing, only you have to stop and go. You lift off pretty much right away. You only go down one half step. It's kind of like the beginning with the... Then it, I think System of Down does this a lot. It mocks the beginning. Only you do kind of what I do as the second guitar. Only you hit the second string down this time. Five, seven, five, seven, open. Wait, okay, five, seven. Five seven open seven seven nine seven nine open The first time after the open you go to the seven. On this one you land on the seven still, which was my mistake. Four, five, four, five, open. Four, two, three, two, three, open. Three. It kind of alternates. do the slide up that's just me force of habit sounds cool so and another guitar if you want to if you got like in your band more than one person and when you're all trying to play this song it uh, also once again mocks the beginning with the I've never attempted that but you can 
hear it in the song definitely so anyway so after you do that you know angels deserve to then you go same thing everything all over again except uh, you actually hold the for a little while after the first um, chorus and you do that again then you do the I tried to keep this video under 10 minutes I failed who cares okay so after all that and then you get to father, father, and you have to do that. When they're screaming, father, father, you can actually mute it with the... I can't mute that good one playing the song, I never really attempted it. Then you go back to the... You bar the first three on seventh fret. You pretty much do this for the rest of the song. Seven, three, third fret. On the tenth fret, slide up to ten. Three. At the very end, you kind of have to go with the song three, 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 seven, and there you go. Go. I got a speech effect at this point, or somewhat that I can't even talk right. Anyway, like I said, um, I'll be teaching a um, teaching posting a beginners video. It's a lot simpler than this one. Um, Thanks for watching. Um, no making fun of the way I talk. Skip the do. Who cares anymore? Okay, bye, kids. Okay, my computer froze. I won't let me show off the video. God damn it! Yeah, shut it off. I will kill you.